That was Kimberly Lee with Like a River. Here on your radio station, AM 930, The Light, Edmonton's Positive Talk. Well, listen to what David had to say in Psalm 133, verse number 1. He says, How good and pleasant it is when brothers and sisters dwell together in unity or in harmony. So, of course, he's looking at his time period. He was looking over the temple area, and he saw all the people heading into the temple area, and he saw how that, you know, the Lord was being glorified and honored. He heard the uh, Levitical uh, different types of choirs and singers, and he thought, this is absolutely wonderful. And of course, the focus of all that unity was the Lord himself. Now, Fast forward it to another time period where Jesus had told his disciples to tarry until they be endued with power from on high. So for a time period, they were in the upper room. And the Bible says on the day of Pentecost, they were in one accord. That means that they were in harmony and they were in unity. They wanted to see one thing happen. And that was, of course, the pouring out of the Holy Spirit. And it did happen. And it began a revival and a movement that is still going around the world today. So when we are walking in unity and harmony, there is absolutely nothing that can stop us. However, if we find ourselves in division, whether it's by ourselves, we can do that to ourselves, uh, when it comes to couples or families or churches or communities, we don't accomplish much. That's why the enemy is constantly trying to sow division. So today we make a decision. What's that decision? We're going to choose to forgive. We're going to choose to love. We're going to choose to accept. We're going to say, God, we're going to do, like Paul says, make every effort to keep the unity of the faith. Now that's a decision. It's not easy to do. But when we do it, nothing is impossible with God when we're working together. And that's how David said how good and pleasant it is when brothers and sisters live together, walk together, and work together in harmony and unity. Let's make that our aim and goal today. Now we have for you right now, we have North Park Community Church with He Reigns. 